good, good. Oh, we're just uh, filming a vlog. I'm just asking him some questions and. Uh... Oh, okay. Oh, I see, I see. Even if we're just talking, you know. Oh, I see, I see. So I was thinking about tips on inflation, look for deals in a slow market. Would you rather pay 20% more at 3% interest rate or 20% less at 5% interest rate? Number one, the law of value. Your true worth is determined by how much more you give in value than you take in payment. The second law, your income is determined by how many people you serve and how well you serve them. Yeah. Number three, the law of influence. Your influence is determined by how abundantly you place other people's interests first. Law number four, the law of authenticity. The most valuable gift you have to offer is yourself. Number five, the law of receptivity. The key to effective giving is to stay open to receiving. So those are the five laws, but I won't spoil and I won't go into too much detail. What's it called? The Go-Giver. It's a five-hour read, uh, sorry, five-hour listen on Audible. We're here at 933 Seymour Street. We're, I'm checking out a listing, Airbnb-friendly listing for one of my investor clients. And then the great thing about this is there are not very many Airbnb-friendly buildings in the city. You guys will see, it's got lots of cool little spaces, yeah. so it rents out really well. You know, if this there's... unit was not rented Airbnb, what's a typical long-term rental rate for? Uh, like downtown this? for a one-bedroom like this, you're probably looking about twenty-five hundred bucks That's a month. Pretty good. Yeah. That's pretty good. Even though it might look like it's narrow, but like because of the high ceilings, it's really spacious. I like how they changed the light fixtures. A little bit of rustic feeling. It's like obviously quote unquote staged, you know, for Airbnb tenants. Uh, washer and dryer with like a big spacious closet over there. Uh, so I have a webinar at about 3.15. So in the meantime, we're gonna go grab coffee and just like walk around the neighborhood and we'll just talk about real estate. My real estate journey has been pretty like up and down. Hi, can I get a table for two? What are we doing right now? We are waiting for a table. We are waiting for a table. Because they said that they, the table that I see is vacant needs to be cleaned. So I'm waiting for them to clean that table. Good, good. Oh, we're just uh, filming a vlog. I'm just asking him some questions and... Uh... Oh, okay. Oh, I see, I see. Even if we're just talking, you know? Oh, I see, I see. Thank you. Thank you. Have you heard of that saying from mutual funds? Historical performance is not a determinant of future. Entrepreneurs think they achieve some sort of success and then, oh, I don't need to work anymore. When it's conscious, you're like, oh shoot, I have been arrogant. The worst part is it's a blind spot. Hopefully you realize it before it's too late. Today's webinar is with my mortgage broker. We're gonna be talking about the effect of interest rates and how is it affecting the market? How is it affecting the typical buyer when they're like trying to get financing? So I'm looking forward to that. Thanks everyone for joining our monthly webinar with uh, my favorite mortgage broker, Jordan Thompson. So you don't necessarily have to walk into that five year fix and looking at your personal situation. Um, and that might be a good option. So definitely talk, talk to your mortgage broker. Thank Wonderful. you. Well, thanks, for your time. thanks, Gary, for having me. It's been, it's always a pleasure. Yeah. So, so, so if you're a three hundred thousand dollar mortgage, that's why it's super important to have a really good mortgage yeah, broker no, and talk to them regularly about okay, what's the best strategy. The owner directly. Yeah. Only maybe speak uh, I understand one of your colleagues can speak. Yeah. Yeah. English. That's right. Bye-bye. Okay, bye. Okay, so what are we going to talk about? How many mainstream uh, speakers do you see, like, who are, like, Chinese? There's two, Kiyosaki and... Yeah! <laughs>
Yeah, the mainstream public speakers in North America, like influencers. You don't, not that many. So we created a, ser a few videos on foreign buyers and why foreign buyers is actually good. I mean, we'll talk about real estate. We'll talk about. Let me get more water. Mindset, but